Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maiden. We have um, our elevator pieces here, and we need to make them better. Uh, we, well, we need to finish it. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this. No, we're not. We're going to copy selection. We're going to take this portion here. That's going to be four. Let's place them so it works like that. So that is... Oops, hold on. Oh, oh good. That didn't put anything down. So we're going to turn on creative mode. So that's four. Uh, that's eight. That is... this and see how tall this actually is. It should be what, 15? It should be like 20. From here is 20. We just need to get rid of this top one. All right. I think that is going to be a reasonable, well, at least for the, not maybe not reasonable, but that's going to be a decent, uh, decent glass elevator. All right. So, as I said before, we need to readjust everything here. Uh, that's the wrong button. Shift-V. Why did you do that? Those are already connected. Yeah, but I'm connecting them and reconnecting them gets these guys too. All right. Then, we need to design our interior. Um, probably going to do something like this. This. Wait a minute. Is that missing a block? Uh, block. That is indeed missing a block. All right. So let's down, grab you, and everybody's playing down. There we go. This guy as well. Okay. Uh, there we go. That doesn't do anything. Now our... Hold up. Why are we not moving up now? Because you were playing down. Okay. Now let's... There we go. Always test your logic if something is wrong. Also, I know you put it together right, but no, you didn't. Something is wrong. I don't know what's wrong. I can't tell you that. But something is wrong. All right, we're going to rip these two out. We're going to go ahead with the three quarters there. There. And three quarter here. And ye old this here, except I want you to be... Lights. Um, you are going to be a yellow light. Going to be off. And we need some, like, regular lights. Um, let's hit I instead of T this time. I grab some white lights. Why are you not in with the other? Oh, you are in with the other lights. Why is a beacon in between there? And let's hit R to get out of the... Uh, get out of the... Um, ship instead of pressing the button I intended to. There we go. Oops. Game, why you do this? All right, there we go. We have an elevator, and it's all pretty and good and all that jazz. Let's just pop this off and let's give it a more decorative um, more decorative uh, thing here. Can you give it a is this going to line up? No, that's not going to line up right. All right. Uh, let's see. It lines up that way. Thrusters will. The thrusters line up that way. Okay. All right. That'll do. And let's grab a... 
plex door and some glass door. And we're going to run these here and let's pop that out. Awesome. And glass door. We're just going to do a full glass door. And where's our motherboard? Comes a wedge here, so you can press the button. That's why I wedged over here. So now you can press this button while, uh, while this door is closed. All right. Okay, so we have that. What else do we need? We need, um, what? Yes, that, that is needed, isn't it? Hmm. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm, we're, I'm getting, going astray thinking and, and not doing what we need to be doing. So we need an and, and a activation module. We're going to put those, oops. Good spot for these. Not really. Here's a D, not a good spot. And, and a not. There, there's, it'll be nice and compact. This activation feeds into this knot. This knot controls this door. So when it's not, the, so when it is, the door is open. And when it's not, the door is closed. So let's go down and we're going to grab this connection point and feed it to the old activator. All right, so this means when we move up, that should be off. Now when we move down, that should turn back on. When it hits, it turns on and opens the door. Awesome. All right. Uh, something else I needed to do. Oh, well, while we're thinking about it, let's get some rail speed controllers in here. I want to rotate it not for any actual reason other than... Um, I can see it better this way. So now this uh, elevator should move a lot faster. There we go. Yeah. Bring him back down. Okay. Now we're cooking with gas. So this is going to be the bottom of all our station because our controls are here. So we're going to copy brush of Five by five by five. Are you copying brush so I can do that? East brush. There. We're going to rip all this out in favor of our regular old this. So, so now let's grab these and make sure everything works right. We're going to cycle this logic on and off. Now we're going to run our elevator shaft up and see if this door opens. See if the logic copied properly. Because that's not how doors work. All right, and apparently it doesn't stop. Oh, it doesn't stop long enough to. Oh, 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 it didn't stop properly because it's going to be this one that feeds to it. All right. That one feeds to it, not the one in the actual... Oh, nope, nope, not this one. Hold on. Not you. You feed to it because the one in the actual template got cut off. All right, let's try that again. We're going to run up, and eventually we should see that pop for just a moment. Pop. Oh, there we go. All right. So we know that works. Let's take her down, and then let's do this. Let's copy the selection from here upwards. Gonna paste that.
Let's grab all of this and fire her up. And they're gonna make sure. Oh, you need all of these too, because I don't want you to slow down after a while. All right. That one should have popped, and this one should pop because we actually copied the right. Yep, that one popped because we copied the right, and it will never need to go that tall. So we are going to then terminate from here. Make sure you go up. I deleted the wrong thing somewhere in there. Yep, and it lands right here at this landing. All right, so the top and the bottom are going to be easy. They're going to be easy to do. However, the middle one is going to be more problematic. Let's see. Um, we can do this. Excellent question. Go ahead and put these guys here. Actually, you really don't matter. Well, you do matter, but I'm going to put this here anyway. All right. So we're going to have the, I guess, the control room here. Bottom, unless I want the control room up. No, I want the control room in the middle because that seems more secure. Anyway, this is our central elevator, mostly hooked up. So we are going to then, um, hmm, how do I want to do this? Normally I just wire all these up together. So we're going to say you are just going to get wired to here. This call button, oh, we can't do that. Uh, how about we do this? All right, we're going to have to do this. We're going to add a side control room. Does it need to be that big? No, it doesn't need to be that big. But if I'm building in a 5x5, five five, yes, it does. Otherwise, it's going to get off somewhere. Go and then you, my friend. There we go. All right. So I can do all the logic -y stuff here. You are going to come over and going to attach to a small button. We're going to attach all these first. Button. Button. Why was I holding down Alt for that? And the button. And you. Getting those turns on our small buttons. Why didn't you just put small buttons in here? Excellent question. So we're going to attach you to this one. I guess I could have actually waited and wired this up better. Bottom one. All right. Hits, hits, hits. Both of those. All right. Make sure these work. It's, it's, it's both of those. Ah, that's what, that's, that's the reason I didn't uh, wire these together because I didn't want, or wire these buttons on the inside because I didn't want you to see the, the movie magic on the inside to see that this button and this button both do the same thing. That's why. In fact, we can get rid of these extraneous side buttons and just wire them into the proper one anyway. Now that, there because we're going for wireless. We don't need to go from small button to small button. We can just go from large button to large button. And that one actually is at the top, so it should probably fire the top one. Middle and bottom. All right. So we're going to need a top, middle, and bottom control. This also gives me the opportunity on two, three, uh, standard, don't we? One any tall five by five that gives me opportunity for more room here. 
and so what we're gonna need we're gonna need a, a down sideways and an up but we are going to handle that next time so i believe we are uh we're good for now all right so we have a bottom a middle and a top so this particular layout will give us well three levels as you can see and we can have other le levels we'll probably stack this higher and higher and higher but that's going to get a little more complicated and i just want a, a quick and easy base for us uh, not a base but a base for the base anyway a central hub we can attach other modules too quickly anyway i have been jw608 this has been star me and i will dig you cats later and later is when we are going to uh actually wire this thing up properly i'll see you then